get into Hax's head a little bit. Are we going to Fountain Dreams first? Let's see. We may wow. very well be doing this. Yeah, I would be surprised to see that Chillin' went here, but uh, perhaps he knows something I don't. Alright, so coming in with those lasers. Uh, the only thing Ooh. I can think of... Done! Oh. Simple. Quick, easy rest. Smash Studios Soft. Three. Ooh. You see, he tried to come in with that uh, up air, and then he would might have done up tilt to rest or just rest him out of it. But up throw to up air is a very, uh, very nearly guaranteed option for, for Fox. Yeah, very nearly. Even when DI'd. Chillin makes it look easy, but that is a very hard uh, thing to do. The, the timing on jumping up there and timing your jumps properly and then following their DI is very specific, very hard, but Chillin makes it look free. Now, free like that rest. I want to point out two things. First and foremost, Chillin has been opting to run in and shield every once in a while. And we may very well see Soft just grab him out of that if, if that becomes a more common approach. So he can't really rely on that. And secondly, he cannot come in with those full hop drills in the same way because as you saw there, if they're not timed perfectly, he can get grabbed out of it before he can land and shine. And so now we're starting to see patient soft come out. Tried to catch him rolling backwards. Good weight. I'm definitely curious. around on the ledge. Coming up doing aerials with the invincibility. Chillin wants a falling up air right now. You can see it on his face. Jigglypuff is yep. <laughs> suspended in air for so long after that air dodge. Oh, that was good oh, recovery. Almost caught him with the up air. Chillin's falling up air. Mm -hmm. I would kill him at this percent. Ooh, good shine to back air. Closes it out just decisively. Now, this Ooh. is good one of those matchups where... <gasps> oh, he's going to pay for this. Good DI. Oh, this is one of those matchups where percentage means almost nothing. <laughs> it's they, they may as well not have percentages. Because just about either of these characters can kill the other at any time. Yeah, um, I believe it was Mango who said that uh, you pay a lot for rest, but you have to go for him because you're going to die about 40% anyway. Yeah, Ma Mango, Mango's guide to Jigglypuff is go for rests against Fox because you're just going to die no matter what. Yep. It's on Smash Bros. Go read it. It's thoroughly, thoroughly entertaining. But... Do it after this match, because... Ooh! <laughs> Get wrecked. You just ate a forward smash because you drilled that poorly. It's such a, like, it seems like a move that should be... <gasps> oh! Tries to catch him on the roll-in. That spot dodge could have been punished with rest. Up smash, 69%. Oh my Chillin' just patiently controlling the middle. <gasps> oh! Uh, wow. Maybe a back throw there. I'm surprised he didn't go for just jab to, to rest. Oh, that was... He is fishing a little bit too hard for this kill with those up smashes. But this is exactly what I meant, where we're going to see him trying to get the kill the same exact way. Until he goes and just tries to go for a much safer hit, like a back air and up air. This is not so going to pull it off. Oh my God. Soft is looking for those up smashes. And, he's, oh, and he finds one right in the teeth <laughs> and gets sent off the top of Fountain of Dreams. Chillin, Curse Chillin shouts out, yes. Yeah, he was very excited about that kill, and as he should be, he read that roll out to ledge very nicely. That was that was a, a textbook up smash. That was, that was great. Down to the wire. Yeah, either player could have died from any straight hit. Wow. Soft thinks that... Uh, should have taken that game. This is a good stage for Puff. I'm surprised Chillin is confident here, but it worked out for him last time. Maybe because Puff, Puff gets interrupted by the platforms or something? I'm not sure what, but oh. he tries to jump inside B and it fails. And that has the potential to really mess with his mentality. <laughs> he just came, oh, sorry, we just came out of a game where, where he had uh, the, the lead for almost the entire, uh, almost the entire game. And, uh, and then as soon as you come in here, you, you die to a, a very poor recovery. Yeah, he's a little shaking. He almost missed that one, too. Uh, yes. Bad option. Bad position. And he's done. Don't do that, Chillin'. Chillin' dude not pleased with himself. A complete turnaround from the other game. 30%. Soft has barely been touched. <gasps> and again! Like here? Is this better? Yep. Up more. Okay, so Chillin right. just got gimped again. 
Uh, and that's one thing, when Chillin dies, when he gets that, that anger and that frustration, he's so much more willing to just jump off stage for no real reason. And you don't want to do that against Puff. <gasps> or Done. Oh, dumb Wow. Space. Good DI, but not enough. From a close match to a three stock. And that's, that's just how Puff Fox goes, because they can kill each other so quickly. And where are we? Is this two out of three or three out of five? I think it's still two out of three. No It way. is still oh, two out gosh. of three. So, so this determines who gets sent to the loser's bracket. And that. the loser's bracket is a gauntlet at this point. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I definitely think that Chillin has the slight advantage because... Oh my god. Wow. Read the DI, followed him perfectly. But he has a slight advantage just because he won the first match. Now he gets to play on his counter pick on his terms. And this is such a great stage. <gasps> oh! It's hard for Jigglypuff to do that when she's down, though. She gets punished for it. Well, still. Work. No, I, oh, I've done... No, absolutely a good decision. <laughs> oh, that could spell death for him. No. Soft misses the regrab. Oh, oh, Nair into up smash. Great option. Killed at 79%. Mm. It's actually, I mean, lower. L lower because the hit itself added percent. But yeah, think about that. That was just one Nair to one up smash. That was like, you can't escape it, and it's an easy move to come in with. Oh. Done. But Jigglypuff's probably going to die from this. Very possibly. Yep. That's what I was saying. When Jigglypuff's down a stock, it's very hard for her to get rest follow-ups because she risks death. Ooh, good option to ledge, or I'm sorry, to uh, to wave land onto the stage like that. Chillin doesn't have to go in there if he doesn't want to. Apparently, he does want to. Chillin's but so good with that mix-up. He's been so aggressive to wait after the nair and just grab. I would have fallen for that nine times out of ten. Oh my god, I can't believe that Chillin has switched his style up so much within the last just game. Well, have oh my the god. room to work with was important. And that's it. That's it. That's the end of it. Chillin just dominated that last that last game. He says, what's up? Curse Chillin. Good stuff, Chillin. Yeah, man. Uh, yeah, though, the fact that he just waited, because like that last few stonks, he was so much more patient and just reactionary mm -hmm. as opposed to going for those hard reads off stage. That's that was correct. really well done. I think he's coming to give us like, a couple of shout outs, man. Shout out to Team Curse. At Team Curse Gaming on Twitter. TeamCurse.net. Shout out to Papa Paint for making this sick reveal video for me on Team Curse. Mm -hmm. Team Curse. Wait, who sponsors him? Uh, is he, wait, he's sponsored? Probably not. Dude, it's crazy. No, he's, he's been walking around. Let me move my mic. He's been riding around on his high horse ever since.